plant and went to other planets or galaxies. Yes. And he's another guy. He could do anything. So if he wants to beat Aquaman, he just rubs his lantern and he says, die Aquaman or whatever. Okay. Uh, what's the next one? Stan, we are not talking about rubbing lanterns in this. We're not rubbing any lanterns here, okay? This is Aquaman. This is a, this is a guy who can communicate with sea life. He's, he basically, he can breathe underwater. The, the, it, when he's in water, he's practically invincible. Aquaman. I mean, it's Aquaman. It's not, you know, he doesn't get his powers from some ring. He is his powers. But if the two of them are about to fight. Right. Aquaman. First of all, the Green Lantern would be crazy to dive into the water. He'd rub his little whatever he rubs, and he'd See, bring Aquaman out of the water, and he'd uh, have him float somewhere, and then he'd rub the thing again, and he'd kill See, him. And we, what? There's, there's know, no, we're it's not, too easy. Dan, it's we're too not, basic. We're not double rubbing. That's not. We're, this isn't. All right, look, I'm trying to put up a good argument for Aquaman, but I'm going to. There's no way. I'm going to have to agree with Stan and say Green Lantern will whip Aquaman, obviously. But I was trying for Aquaman. Can we just assume? that I will win all of them and then go on to a different that, kind of that is That is not procedure. a safe assumption. He is trying to just take over the situation here. <clears throat> well, it's just somebody has to. You're just sitting there. All right, fine. Green Lantern. Superman versus Green Arrow. So let me, again, let me qualify this. Green Arrow is just a man who can shoot arrows and he's, his shot is impeccable. That being said, unless he has kryptonite arrows, he has no chance against Oh, Superman. I didn't think of that. Oh, a kryptonite arrow. A kryptonite arrow. That's why you get the big bucks. He, now, I would never have thought of that. He, that's right. He's probably the only person who could shoot an arrow and hit Superman who's dodging. Right? Wow. As fast as Superman is, Green Arrow can anticipate and all this other stuff. So if he has kryptonite arrows and he can do, get, you know, can take a shot, he has a chance. A chance. But that doesn't change my final decision, which is Superman will whip his ass. Even w being hit with a kryptonite? You arrow? know, the chances that he's going to have any kryptonite. Kryptonite is like, you know, more elusive to get than plutonium. No, but you, we're just assuming. You were assuming he had a kryptonite arrow. Well, it, now you're going against your own opinion. No, no, no. I, I, was, I, I was theorizing that if he had one, he'd have a chance. Well, he could have one. Yeah, well, but the thing is, there's a lot of people who have kryptonite and they still fail to beat Superman. They yeah, but they fail. don't have kryptonite arrows like Green Arrow. Well, why are you being... All of a sudden, I'm a big Green Arrow fan. You're, you're being difficult. Yes, I tend to. Okay, that's where we were going to agree here that Superman would win. That's what we were going to do. I was going to say there's not even any contest. Of course Superman would win, but you cleverly, brilliantly came up with the idea of Green Arrow having a kryptonite arrow that never occurred to me then superman becomes clark kent so to speak and he can beat him he can shoot another arrow at him and maybe kill him i go with green arrow i go with superman and i go with green arrow on a cut of you how can you contradict me all these years i've known you you finally came up with a good idea and and you're walking away from it it was a theory all right Aquaman's sitting there and he's pretending he's like, oh, that boxing glove hurts. Mm. Then all of a sudden he's like, doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm not pushing. I'm just, I, I've. Enjoyed. Are we really gonna do this? Yes, we're doing this. Let me tell you something. Aquaman, it's a fish. <laughs>